Welcome everyone. I am back. Today is July the 22nd, 2022. We're going to talk about Ethereum today. We're going to see um, whether or not the bull run can continue. You guys can see that Ethereum is in an upward move right now. Is it still strong? I'm going to give you all my Ethereum price analysis today. So welcome everyone to my channel. Uh, to those who are new, if you are and you all appreciate my videos, my content after you see this one, make sure you hit that like button. Send and also subscribe to my channel, turn the bell notification as well, because I'm strictly here to show you all that it's very possible for you to predict prices and win at the same time. So if you're interested in that, if you're interested in learning more about how I do this, then you need to continue to see my content. All right. So let's go ahead and talk real quick. Uh, did a video in Ethereum all the way back on July the 7th. You guys can see I was looking for the price in Ethereum to go up and you all can see it. That that is exactly what happened, right? I, I was prepared to see the price in Ethereum go up. The market has already done it. If we were to get out the market today, our profitability would be 38 and three quarters of percent. Or if anything, we got 18% out the market. It's just that simple. All right, let's get rid of that. Let's talk about this overall Ethereum price analysis because we want to make the determination if Ethereum is going to continue on this bull run. I mean, since the low of july the 13th let's see how high the market has already gone in ethereum so price has already went up 62 percent already so at some point you may think well the sellers might come in and start profit taking you know might try to take some of their profitability out of the market and bring the price of ethereum back down that's very well may be the case but the market may still be strong to where we may actually expect the market move to continue to go up let's talk let me show you all the two-day chart real quick because you all can see over the last couple of two days, the market in Ethereum has just been hovering sideways right now, right? The market current restriction area is around $1,640. $1,640 is the current area of restriction, which brings us to the problem. This is the problem right now in Ethereum, okay? So I'm saying around like $1,750, uh, $1,740 as the problem for the buyers. This is the closest area that we're gonna see the market in Ethereum get inundated with some selling meaning i'm expecting the price to get rejected there and then try to come back down okay so we are already nearing this price so we might see the market hit its head a couple of times and then price go down in ethereum so overall we want to figure out can the market break that because if so then we're still sitting pretty good to allow this bull run to continue in ethereum okay so this is Ethereum right now on the three day chart. Uh, currently, the market looks pretty good on this current three day price bar, but we still have one day and 14 hours left. So we cannot be fully confident into what we're seeing here now, but it does look good so far. Ethereum on the five day. And again, you guys can see right here on the five day chart that Ethereum still looks pretty decent, right? The market is looking like it still wants to extend itself a little bit higher. Now the concern that we see here, okay? I'm going to extend this out further all the way back to June of 2021. Take a look. The market in Ethereum at that particular moment in time was acting as support. Now this area is going to act as restriction. So I really want to put everyone on guard that the market can definitely get rejected around 1740, 1725 and come back down. This may be the end of the bull run in Ethereum. Look at Ethereum right now on the weekly. I like the weekly chart, but it's still contingent. Just like I told you on the two day chart, this is not completed. So we still have two days and 14 hours left on this current weekly price bar. But let's just say for instance, that today was the last day and we only got like 30 minutes on this current weekly price bar. I will still be bullish, right? Even to the point to where I wouldn't even be suspecting that uh, 1750, 1740 would not impact the buyers from moving up higher. Okay. so. That's pretty much the only problem I see. It's $1,740, $1,750. That's the only thing that's in this way. So don't be surprised if the market in Ethereum gets rejected there because I'm here telling you right now that that could literally stop the progression of movement of Ethereum from going up. Okay. So let me go ahead and put this back because I am suspecting that the market in Ethereum has a little bit more gas in the tank. Um, it may not be much. Let me see. 
So another six and, and a quarter percent. Okay, that will have to be my first price target. I'm just gonna keep it real. $1,740, give or take, around that area would have to be the first area for us to see the market in Ethereum get rejected. If we see the market break that to the upside, my second price target is going to be up here around $1,925. $1,925. Now, let me get rid of that. I'm going to extend this downtrend line because this may be the ultimate goal, the ultimate objective of the market trying to reach long term. Okay, so we may actually see the market in Ethereum bring the price all the way back up here to this descending line, get rejected and begin this downward move again. Okay, so I'm going to extend that downtrend line so we can keep track of that. So we can actually see how high the market is going to go because we ultimately know that this is the problem for the bulls in the long term is for them to break outside of that long term downtrend line. Okay. But so far, I'm just going to give you two price targets. Uh, that first one is $1,740. The second one is right there around $1,925. But long term, if we continue to see this bull run like we've seen already, I wouldn't even be surprised to see the market in Ethereum try to hit that $2,000 price. But I'm not going to put that on the chart yet. Okay, so that's it. I'm done. Go ahead and take the opportunity out to give me your ideas to where you think uh, Ethereum is, is headed right now. I'm still looking for the price to trend higher. OK, still looking for the market to go up, but I, I suspect that we are going to see some sellers entering the market in Ethereum. So this is not the opportunity to become complacent. This is not the opportunity to come and act like we're no longer in a downtrend just because Ethereum has ran up 60 some percent already. OK, so let's just keep it real. Let's keep it focused. OK, so this is it. Just wanted to come and update you all as to what I'm seeing on the price chart for Ethereum. Nothing hard, nothing too difficult. So I just want to give you all the opportunity as well. The comment section is open on this video so that you all can give me your price prediction. Give me your price target and let me know where do you see the market in Ethereum headed as we approach the month of August. How about going into September as well? Over the next two months, how, how are we going to look? How will the market in Ethereum look in the next two months, right? Because as this market move continue to go up, you will expect more and more people to become more bullish, more and more people beginning to jump on the bandwagon and try to ride the market up higher. So give me your thoughts. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.